hey guys so i am back i know like i haven't talked at all because you know my logs are just great and whatever but i'll probably talk oh the sun i'll probably talk in literally um, now because well when i had accidents so i had to change out of my clothes and i just wore like a onesie with this blazer because we're going to dinner right now but so that's what's happening also, it's just a walk, and I don't be ta inter interested in talking and walking at the same time, so that's also why. But, um, you guys are gonna head out with us to go to dinner. I don't know what the restaurant's name is, I don't know which restaurant we're going to, but I just know we're going to dinner, and so I'm fine with that. <laughs> this chair makes so much noise. I think it needs like oil. Um, there's one thing that I also was looking for, but I can't find it. Oh, there it is. <laughs> oh, this is why if you watch my Amazon um, haul, this is why these are so important. <laughs> not having one is ridiculous. And so I'm going to charge my work phone right now. Also, I need to drink some antibiotics. Also, I hope I put my, where are my AirPods? I don't know. I think I just saw something fly. Jenica will be buying some. I will be buying some Maria. Trust and believe me. So, let's head out. Eight nine. Eight nine. Their dinners aren't heavy. They eat heavy lunch. Oh. Okay, guys. So we're walking for dinner, and this lighting is depressing. Okay. Walking for dinner. Oh. Seeing some sights. Walking. I'm heaving right now. Okay. What's this one? Cut. Cut. That's Oh! Go watch this darkness. Oh, oh, that I got the joke now. Okay. Yeah, we could go see the view. Oh, yeah, because that's there is life was not for me. But, um, obviously, I think I'll come up here another day when I look good. When I look good and when, you know, the darkness isn't sweltering me. Can't be walking backwards on this cobblestone. It's how you get killed. Because I almost tripped like six times today. Okay, goodbye. Little truck that's about is as wide as I am tall. Like, hey guys, so oh, can you get out? Oop. 
just got in. Um, not that sweaty, but just got in. So super duper do per like tired. Hey girl, it's beat up. We're beat over here. Okay. Okay. Great. Now that you guys know. I am beat and that I am pudgy and my stomach is literally the pudgiest. I will now go ahead and just like not clean up really, but um, get my life together. <laughs> some wind down routine because the girl is lit literally okay I don't know I can leave this open it would be great if I could but I can't so we'll figure this out tomorrow okay I'm going to go and take a shower first and foremost second of all I'm going to lay in my bed Make some calls to family and then leave. Okay, so hey guys, this is actually my first time being able to like walk, walk and talk. I'm also on my phone right now because, yeah, I just don't have any time to like, oh, I'm also reading a book. Um, this is also my first time going to dinner alone. I shouldn't say that out loud. But anyway, it's fine. Um, so yeah, walking down this hill that I know I'm going to dread walking up later. But right now we're heading for dinner at Trattoria something something. Oh. That sounds very pretty. Um, also, you just have to listen for cars because if you don't, you literally will get run over. Well, I doubt they'll run me over, but not fun so, okay guys so change plans i'm going to miva because you know it's closer uh, and i was like the chances of getting lost so that's what i'm doing and so let's go Okay guys, we're back and better than ever. Um, yesterday I recorded all of my phone, so if you're wondering why like, the quality is super weird, that's why. But today's OOT of the day is my Walmart Berkey's uh, off-brand. Um, this cute pants from Shein, also top from Shein. But I bought this like a very long time ago. I bought a lot of my clothes like a very long time ago. But a very long time ago, I mean like three months ago, before I started seeing like all those like ads about help me and stuff. And despite it being like cheap, uh, I was talking to a friend 
about like how it's robbing from like small businesses so i was just like you know what whatever i just will keep the clothes that i have whenever i have a chance to buy from small business i would because small business are expensive but you know that's expensive to put back into your country but anyway so this is the outfit of the day i'm standing like my boyfriend and ooh, or it's giving uh, cute, chic, you know, all the above. Ugh, guys, let me tell you, while I'm here, I'm losing weight. I'm gonna start going for runs. Um, it's just been really hectic. I'm like, what is this? Today is like day four. Right now, being in Italy. Oh, why am I hyping, like, heisting this thing up? But it's day four of being in Italy. Let me just tell you, you cannot spend a week here and, like, figure everything out. And I'm not even, like, in a bunch of different places in Italy. Not even close. But, um, so, agenda for today. Agenda for today is we are going to the antique fair. They're having in the square, in the Piazza Grande. I saw that. I'll hear that accent. It's giving. Mm. Then, um, we have, a, like, a, a work lunch that we have to go to. So I'll be there, and then after that we have a renaissance, um, like, theater program. I'll be there, that's also for work. So not really going to get a lot of coverage of those, like, two things, probably just, like, the food. But, but, um, the coverage yesterday of, yeah, like, the, uh, the Piatra, the, okay, you know what, I'm not even going to pronounce it. I'm going to pronounce it later when I fully read it and take it in again. Because that's me in Italian words, okay, guys? Also, I hope you guys get to hear me like have conversations because I am killing this language game. Not really. I'm actually doing a pretty bad job. Um, I'm trying to figure out what else exactly I have to do before I leave. But we're leaving at 9 and it's 8.51. So it's probably time to go. Um, yeah. So I'll see you guys at the fair. <laughs> From a mile away. He is one in 65. Ooh, this see, is, I know. Uh, this is Panama Astro. Oh. You can change the shape. Not you said you can change the shape. Oh, it's giving me. You know what? He, he is trying to. Yeah, like that's that's what I'm. I told you that's why I ran. Of course. I think I'm going to get the black. It's more personal. Because this one. This one is definitely more. Like, I feel like this one's giving. The rich that might have at a price. I think it's gotta be at the back. <laughs> at the what? At the back? I decided not to eat dinner today because my stomach was hurting. Let me just tell you. Not a good decision. Not a good movie woman decision. <sighs> I have to go to work. It's currently 10.20. But basically my work is kind of like dealing with like closing up stuff. And so I am doing that tonight. Also, I'm going to eat some chocolate that I just got recent, recently got. The packaging is super cute. Um, 
by Bestry in Italy. It's a family owned company. They're so nice. Um, but it's so cute because it's like body and soul. The milk chocolate enriched with puffed, puffed rice and Ceylon cinnamon. Il chocolato e un dono che la natura ci ha ah my pronunciation crap like the description that i got from this one was like rice crispy vibes and i love 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 rice crispy. i haven't decided if i want to do like um Cosi buono. Mm. This one is so good. There's another one I started eating. Um, and this one is white chocolate. I'm not really a fan of white chocolate, but this one is fire. And it has sesame seeds in it. I actually didn't read. Oh, never mind. Too thin. But the packaging is really nice, like super cute. My best friend, anywhere I go, she's there. But first week in Italy is about to be down, and oh, I feel pretty good about it. I feel pretty good about it. I like how my room. I'm very comfortable and very excited to see where this goes. I feel annoying, and I don't know why, but I feel like when you speak a different language, like, I never realized how much times I said thank you in a day until I said grazie every two seconds someone does something for me. Which, obviously, I don't think that they think that I'm, you know, annoying. Maybe. Which, I'm kind of in that stage in my life where I don't really know, like, where I'm going to end up. Like, I like I think, oh, well, the world's going to end, so it doesn't matter what I do. But then at the same time, it's like, oh, well, I want kids, I want a house, I want a husband. Like, I'm kind of in limbo. And not really limbo because I just moved to a whole different country slash continent. But I'm kind of in limbo about what exactly... I want to do this experience is definitely like it's only been three, four days but it's definitely educated me that there's so much more than the united states or at the bahamas or like that side of the world so it makes me want to go out there but it's also scary because i'm afraid to leave this building this is a 17 minute and 24 second rant that i'm going to cut out mainly but you know just a quick conversation about why i think that this is creepy or I don't know what I want to do with my life, so, because I don't know. But anyway, I'm gonna go work. Bye bye.